Hey YouTube, today I'm going to sh show you guys how to make a uh, toothpick gun or a paper clip and a rubber band. And uh, in my other we video, I told you guys, but t today I'm going to have a tut tutorial about it, or hot, whatever you call it. So first you need something to cut with. I'm using a wire cutter. Then you need a rubber band, a clothespin, something like a to like straighten out with to make smooth, and some toothpicks. First, what you will do is Take this and take it apart. I'm just gonna do this. Then you take whichever one you want, then you cut this right here this part right here and then you're gonna need this rest so I'm gonna do that this part right here so you But you guys having some troubles. <coughs> Cut it with this. And that's how it's supposed to look like now. Look at that. <coughs> then I'm going to use this to make this part right here where to cut not so sharp like you can get splinters with So it looks something like this. Then just you take this, this one right here, the big one that you haven't done anything to. Then take your shin sending thing or whatever. And put it, cut this one so right here, right here. So the thick end is right here. This you want to do this one. So I'm gonna do that. Make sure it's perfect that. At uh, like it's not an uh, angle, it's like a straight line. Should look something like this now. Just like that. Then take this, the spring thing, and put it at the 
bottom. Yeah, the, I think the bottom. Yeah, the bottom. And you slide it through there. It's kind of hard sometimes to some people, so it's kind of difficult, but not to me that much. Sometimes I do. Then make sure that this part goes all the way in over here. So this, make sure you, that it can't fly out. Then take, <coughs> take this part that we took off, put it just like this. That. Then you take your rubber band right here and just twist it. Regularly. Just keep doing that. Sorry guys, you might have some difficulties. Make sure it's not like not really tight so I can just like slide, pick it up and all that. Actually it doesn't really matter. That's the guy now the video said, but I don't really think that, so I'm just gonna put it as not as much, but like a little bit more tighter. It's gonna be like Tight. And just like this. So put the roll again on this part. So that's how it looks like at the end. Then how you shoot it. You push this. You hear a click. So it's all the way back to that part. Right there in the hole. Make sure this thing can stay right here. Then keep this back. Take a toothpick. The mine's a kind of flat one, that's why it's easier for me. Lift it up. Put it in there, make sure the toothpick, like the end where you put it in first, doesn't go right in there, because then it won't shoot. Because it goes be, like at the bottom of it, instead of going pushing it. So then, keep it like that. It's a toothpick. Then hold it like a gun. Then you just pull this, this. But mine didn't shoot because this part wasn't tough enough. So now gotta put it more. Toothpick out. So we got enough. Now I have to take this all apart. <laughs> Sorry for the weight. Take the rubber band out. Put 
this on here. This. Make sure you put it like this. Then put the rubber band on there. Or you put it that. This put the rubber band on. And then it should look something like this again. Do the same thing. Just try it first. Yep, it worked, but didn't go enough power. So I'm gonna do that. Yep. That's how it works, but and one back again, but it's supposed to stay there and just pull the trigger and it's supposed to go up. Here, I'll show you guys with my other one. I painted it. Oh, called it was a Sharpie. Like that. So, I'll put it on there already. Put it back. Oh, it's kind of sticky, so. Then you take a toothpick. Put it in there, then shoot. So I'm gonna do it again. Cock it. Put the toothpick in there. Then pull the trigger. that and that's it YouTube thanks for watching but make sure you do it right because it's my first one it's pretty good so yeah thanks for watching see you guys